which is a town dog now back. I'm going to try to make another hunt this morning. It'll be the first one in about six days, seven, something like that. I uh, had eye surgery last Monday, and I'll have another eye surgery next Monday, which is tomorrow. I <coughs> thought I'd try to get this in, but I don't know if I'll be able to even use a computer after I get this next eye surgery for a few days, enough to, to do this. I may have to have reading glasses or even glasses for the computer, even though I'll have good vision should have good vision at distance right now that eye they operate on is wonderful outside at distance inside it really good a lot better than the other one but it's at the same time when i depend on just it by itself things are a little fuzzy and they said that they, they weren't designed for reading so i may have a problem or, until i get glasses <coughs> i don't know how long i'll have to wait between the next surgery and getting glasses uh, before I can actually process glasses and get a pair to fit right. So I have to wait and see. Uh, it's be at least another six days before I'll even think about that probably. And that starts tomorrow morning. And I'm going to try to do this little video. And I'll put this up front so you know what's going on. But if you've been you watching me or coming around, I don't show up. You don't know why. All right, I'm fixing to go to multiplayer. Start game. Create game. And I'm going to the... Hashful, hash, whatever it is, hunting reserve. I've been hunting. I, I've been hunting all day long, every day this week. I just hadn't videoed. I hadn't really felt like that much, and wasn't on my mind. I was trying to doctor this eye every four hours and stuff. Anyway, I'm gonna try this this morning, and I'm gonna go right there. And here we go to the ground. I wanted to start it like that so you know which hunting area I was in and without me having to explain it you see it and here you go there you go that's the tag right there I should have just let that tell you anyway I'm here that's multiplayer uh I came in a few minutes ago and I didn't even, didn't even move a man I just sort of scanned the map <coughs> tried to determine an area I might want to try to go to but now where I'm going to try to go to is quite a ways away and I've got to get there as quick as I can so I'm going to get a four wheel but I'll try to stop a little ways out and walk on in I don't know if it's anything there to hunt or not and on the way if I find something that really looks interesting I'll stop set up and try it uh, I always carry my full camping gear with me so I can set up and be able to contain without having to run all the way back to the store or get, hurt, get knocked out I'll still be in the area, not somewhere else. That's the way I handle that. All right, we're back into here. And I'm going to go to here. We've got to get to transportation. We've got to get there as quick as we can. There ain't no way to jump there from here. This is the closest house that I've seen. Didn't pay a lot of attention to it, but uh, we're not that far, but pretty good ways, too. We'll have to go through a little valley to get there. Some mountains out there. Hopefully, it's the valley there. It looks like it is on the map. Now we're going to go to the map. Our four wheelers are sitting waiting. Your wheels are here. Uh, let's see what we got now. We zoom out right along in here, right, right there on the right, just below the river and crossing the river. There's, on the left, there's a, one of those rest areas. And I'm going to try to get to that. But now to get there, I'm going to have to go with the mountains between me and there. So I'm going to try to go up this way and get between them mountains. So I'll put a tag here until we get there, and then we'll put another tag going. Well, actually, we've got to go east from there, more or less, for a while. But I don't, we may run across a good hunting area before we get there. If we do, we'll stop and check it out. That's most of the hunting, good hunting I've found has been by accident. Just stop like that and watch the track stop, set up, and turn out to be a pretty good hunt the next morning or something. So let's see what we got going here. I could have did all this off screen, but I'd rather do it on screen myself. Now I gotta find out where the my tag's at. There she is right there. Now I'm gonna go straight to it because it's the way I gotta figure it cross country. I get into more confusing stuff cross country anyway. Now when you got a road you can follow the ways as long as it's getting closer. I didn't know it was a road there, but right now it is. But the road line leads you around on the top of the mountain. Let's cut across. The road line leads you on something you can't get out of. But what I saw straight from here to there should be a, maybe a travel ball. See, there's tracks right there. It's not, hey, 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 watch where you're going. 
This guy can't drive. I'll tell you that much. I get tired riding with him. Where's my tag? Where's my tag? We ought to turn myself plumb around, don't you? Oh, 24. I done, got, done got to that tag while I done done. Okay. Alright, I done got that tag. I was going, I said I was going to go east from here at least. East of this way right here. We'll go east a few minutes. If you don't ride real fast, you have better luck if you have one stop and hunt. If you drive fast, you make so much racket. They will warm them off. The only reason I know for sure they do is because any time you go, you don't find that first thing. If you ride it in there real hard or go through and come back, you don't find that. But I've also been hunting, and another guy come along for a winter, and all them animals run off and run, run over me and everything else trying to get away. So I know they do do that. For the east, back this way a little more. I'm getting up into this mountain here. I don't want to do that. It's probably going to be a little rise between these mountains, but maybe it'll be crossable this way. We'll stop to me and set us a tag if I don't find what I'm looking for. Now, places like this sometimes try to be good places. I don't know what time of day it is. I should have checked that because it tells me a lot about what I'm looking for on the ground. I'm going to stop and check see what time of day it is. I like to know that all the time. That wrong button. This one. Well, i got to get off the four wheel. You won't look at that thing on the four wheel. Come on, get back to me. It's just after lunch. That's a good time to be looking. It ain't a good time to hunt but that much. But see, we've got one set of tracks here going across the road. It's just one set. That's not really enough to draw my attention. He keeps doing wrong. Why? <laughs> As if somebody's telling him wrong, I believe. You have to watch me. I give you bad advice for a minute. I'm not a good hunter, I just like to kill stuff. This track's here for you. Now when I went out yesterday, I went out yesterday hunting in here, and I went to the log camps up north. Two of them up there on the side of the road, about 200 yards apart. A few days ago, we were going to kill probably eight or ten, eight or ten wild hogs up there. Done so good. I thought a couple of days passed. I thought I'd go back over and try it again, see if I could get a couple of more hogs. I got a pair of them. I've done a real good job cleaning up that place for the hogs. They wouldn't come to me. They wouldn't out there. You see a couple way out there, but they wouldn't come to you. I, I set a purple on, on the uh, the other time. I, that stuff is built. I've been here before for sure. Anyway, uh, I've been all over the map. All this map is open. All the uh, lookouts and houses I know of are open. The city out there I don't know of. I've looked, looked, looked. I've got the whole map open. I'm level 27 now. I was on my level, level, probably 8 or 10 or 12 when I last made a video. So I think something like that. So I've come a long ways. I've shot 200 rounds this week or more in here. Spent, I don't know how many hours. 8 to 10, 12 hours a day because they did not have to sit there. Ain't cool. That's right there. Tracks about everywhere there is. And this is the only thing. This place right here. Oh, it's got a pretty good visibility off that way. Right here would have a good visibility both ways, but most of the time you can't put that tripod on, on, on a hilltop or. It, it. I'm not trying to. I better set me a marker so I know where I'm at. Yeah, I'm just about where I'm going to go to. Practice. Anywhere in this area here. D depending on the wind when I get there where I want to set up. Let's set it there and see how far we're on. Maybe already too close. Yep, let's get off this thing. I don't want to take this into the hunt. It does like it. I don't want to walk in our flat foot. If you walk like it right there, you might as well ride it. It's like it's just about as scary. 
but if you'll take your time, it helps. Now, I don't know if it's anything there. I've not been there. It might not be a truck around. I may have to still find somewhere else to go, but I got a tent I can put, get me another four wheeler anytime I want it. I got a tent, I got a tripod, I got everything I need. Got four rifles. The best long range downer I found is that drill rifle, double barrel shotgun. As Justin Wilson would say, that twice barrel shotgun. I like old Justin. He has a lot of good sayings and jokes. Little stories he has to tell. Pretty good cook, dude. Cajun. Lose the anime. I believe. It takes me longer to get there this way. I know that. But it leads the hunting area in, uh, with some integrity to it. Now, even though you don't see it on the get there, I'm still going to probably set up quite a a lot of times that rest area thing will be a place where there'll be something and right now the wind is behind us that's not bad the wind's blowing to our face oh actually to our left about 10 o'clock coming out of the northeast <sighs> almost north but northeast blowing across here yesterday i set up a pig hunt thing I was at one and the wind was behind me. I said, that'd be perfect. Just before I get there, I'll set up. I got there. Just before I got there, I set up and looked at the wind. It done turned around, going the other way. I was blowing right across the hunt. So, need to say, it wasn't much going on down there either. Uh, got a couple. I did finally call me out two pigs. I said, I killed two out of Last time I killed eight or ten there. I spent the whole day there playing around. This time, I must have cleaned up the... They had a hog problem. I went down and I solved their hog problem for a while. There's a few hogs there, but not like it was. You can't call them out every day. I guarantee you. I called out a couple of pretty good deer, and I killed. Off oh, actually, I don't on the first setup. I shot a big buck up to the right of me. I forget where's that. North, south, east, west. I forget. But anyway, I shot him. Knocked him down. Actually, hit him twice. <clears throat> but he still run off and they've got to where they don't give me the tracking they used to they make it harder on me I have all kinds of trouble tracking but I am getting more animals in than I was I was running about 40% on yesterday's hunt I don't think I missed over one it said 80 something percent I don't know if it's yesterday's hunt or not or are they what did they do a job on them well it was yesterday's hunt or Total, I think it was just a ton, about 86 percent. But I don't remember missing over one or two that I did get. I mean, hitting them and then not finding them. Where's my wind still here? I need to be above if I want to be up there, but I can't. So I'm gonna get out here in this open here and look around a minute. I'll see a few tracks. That makes it promising. There's some here, some here, yeah. I got water, I got the rest here, and I got water, I got open fields. I don't really like setting up totally an open field, but that's usually your best bet. Most times, one place lets it up. Getting the woods, it's hard to find a place to put that thing down. If you, you want to put it on a hilltop, you got a little knob and everything around you, lower and you want to get on top, it won't let you. Very seldom it'll let you sit on an actual rough place. It what looks good, but it won't let it. If it's in the woods, it's because it's too rough. Now I can see this whole area here. I don't know what's in it. I don't really. I like to be able to see a little more out in the woods. When I sit up on that stand, I might be able to. Let's put, let's put the tent over here. That's good enough right there. <laughs> see how this old field, it don't argue with me. That don't seem to bother them. Even setting it up don't do much. Now we won't be able to take a nap today. Well, we're going to take a nap, but we won't have time to read. we got to get this done get done. Okay, let's see what we got over here. Uh, next thing I'm going to need is get my tripod. I have to put it in the locker. I believe 
Now, here's where I'm supposed to be. Get it out of the locker, and then you got to go way out of the locker and back into my inventory. That's where I'm at now. And you go down here to the bottom, get this, and you put it in number two, because there's a slot I got open. Then I'm going to go out here and try to decide where I want to put it. Now, it's just like it's on. It starts to rain. <laughs> we don't mind the rain. Rain actually is cover for you, I believe, in here. Now, we all... Well, that's a tent. That's right. Okay. What do I want to... Let me stand up and look around. I need to be standing up on this looking around. Let's see what I think I can see. The higher I get on this hill, the better off I'll be. Now, I'm not going to walk standing up. I'm going to get down and be a little quiet. It does make a difference, it seems like. I don't want to get that tree yarn to block my whole view behind there either. In fact, I might be better off, and that's going to be upwind anyway. I'm downwind. Probably want to be set on the hillside. I'd rather have it up on them trees just about, but that'd block my whole back one. That ain't a good deal. I'm trying to get where I can see that whole field and what's on the other side of me. I'm going to try right along here, I think. Number two. See, too rough to set it there. Should be a place there. Well, I saw it right there. That's there. That's about the best you're going to get. Heel size too steep. Let me set it first. I like to keep it close to the tent anyway. Most time I turn the tent around and it's facing the legs of it so I can go straight out and up it pretty quick. <clears throat> now let's go back in the tent. I've got all the rifles that I've got off. I've been shooting a 243, which works good. If you don't shoot twice, you get full integrity on most of the animals of deer size. Now yesterday I shot that twice like I didn't get any integrity. I'm not worried about integrity, I'd rather not chase him, to be honest with you. I try to get him, if he gets up and runs, I'm going to try my best to hit him again. If I think he's getting up, I'm going to try to hit him on his down. Anyway, well, I got time. Now, we're going to get out of the locker. We got another gun. I got a choice. I, here's four I got that's not out, and I've got the, uh, 240 in the drill rifle out and I can either get out the 22 for rabbits or I can get out the now I haven't been able to hit the thing with 30 or 6 yet but the rifle I'm getting out now is not for use unless something really big comes up I'm going to try it but now the 270 I know works good I know it'll knock them down pretty good and it's but it's too heavy for the deer at least no, no integrity that's a good rifle and I hit with it this thing right here I tried yesterday I missed twice I don't know if it's just if that was a bad shot or what? I hear him already. Little doe, we're gonna let her go this time. Now, I would take her six on the boats. That's money. Now, what was I doing? I was working on my rifle. Shh, I hear you. We're not going to take her. We're going to let her go. Maybe a big buck falling and I'll run it buck off. Well, I don't need... I'm going to pull this out. If it'll let me hit in the rifle, too. Would I ever pull my rifle out? Yeah, I got the 30 out of 6. All right. Now, what we've got to do is go from here and into the here weapons and we'll take the 30 out six we'll put it in number two it allowed it go to the ammo 30 out six poly tip and we'll put it right there i go to the sights and the same one that works on the other gun works on it all of them except the shotgun use the same one so far you could use others, but that's the only one I got and the only thing I don't want to qualify for. I'll run him off. He hard. He ain't run off. I hear him run off. So I'll run him off so I can get to my stand. Sometimes, the way I see it, if he comes to it to you close enough to secure and run, 
when he stomps and runs, he does as much damage for scaring the hunting as it would to kill him in the spot as long as he don't run. You can drop him and leave him laying there. It don't seem to, that one shot don't seem to disturb the hunting as bad as him running, or no worse. That's 600 bucks. And I don't shoot him at first because sometimes that could scare the doe off. be the only chance the doe would have a coming. Now what I've got here, let's go back into the inventory for just a minute. I've got lure, I just pulled out something here, what was it? This, and I can put it right there. So I hear that doe walking in the house still. See the trees coming into place, see there? That's what I said. It may not be a doe either, but it could be, but it may not be. But it breaks out in the open, look at this guy, see the doe, right? she's close now, she's to run. Fixing the brakes here. There's more than one up there. I heard something else too, I believe. Now, see, scared them off. That would have carried that book with him. That boy like a book won't come back. Anyway, the shot wouldn't be as hard on that book as that was. Not have had 600 books. Anyway, we're going to try to hunt here a few minutes. Try to get us a book. Let's see what we got here. Now, I, I, I don't call like you should. In here it seems to work, and that's all that matters. Now I shake this around like I wouldn't, like I think you should in real life. You shake them around with the rattling, make it sound like your two heads tied together, because that's what it's supposed to consist of, or you strike on a tree. Oh, that's that little pig, little little. I don't know what all's in here. One little deer, maybe all's out here. Oh, look, look, standing right yonder. What's that? I'm going to pull this one right here up, and I'm going to see what that is. That's a big rack, look there. He's walking away. I don't like that. Bow! Bow! I just lost the integrity, but I guarantee you make him run less. Now, he could be awful hard to find, but that was a nice shot right first thing. And this was unplanned, so I like that. I'm going to go try to find him. I generally walk slow going after him so I can be quiet and not mess the rest of hunting up. But it don't always work. Sometimes I have to get up and just take off. But anyway, we're going over the hill where he was, wasn't he? Yeah, he was over the hill in the fog. I didn't look at direction. When you get down, you're just lost as a goose. I think he's over the hill over here in the fog. I could be wrong. If we don't find nothing, we'll go back and try to figure out which way we saw him. He's middle of the field, so it don't matter. We should be able to find him all right. I see tracks already. We need a couple. Of, I don't like shooting twice, but I don't like run, walking, chasing them, can't find them either. That's what happens. So right now, if I hit him both shots, the integrity is gone. Most likely. Let me see now. What was I trying to think about? Oh, reload the gun. Put them shell back in the gun. I might eat all five of them in a minute. This thing holds five with a 270 holds four. What's a big spot right there? Is that a blood spot or is that a... Yep, two blood spots up here. Oh, I said, that wasn't it. That's a poop. I said, I do see the blood spots over there side by side. I don't think he'll go too far. I believe it was a lung shot. Second shot was just tried to keep him down, so I tried to do it. Didn't work. If that first one was a long shot, then the second one was just, just wasted. Other than, but yet it'll slow him down. It's got to. If they give you credit for it, it'll slow him down. I'll see two shots on the ground. These will give me what happened, but it won't give me which direction. But she took off right back up through yonder. There's that little doe again, or another one. Now right here is where I get into trouble. I just want to kill everything I find while I'm walking. If it's a buck, he, he kisses goodbye, I'll pop it if I see him. May never find a vital hit out there. Got a lung. Both of them says vital hit. Alright, right there's a poop pile, but that's not...
No, they don't give you no. Sometimes you, you take out, you don't find a thing here lately. I see something right there. I'm about to blood spot. All right. They'll give you two blood spots, one, most time one, and you cannot straighten him out. It takes forever. And I have I've seen times he wouldn't give me nothing else until I shot something else. That happened. I, I, I was killed one yesterday. I said, kill him. I shot him. He run off. And he had two blood spots and nothing else. Not a track. Cow, it, it grow wings and flew. That's all I got to tell you. And I walked over the circle for a half mile, quarter mile all around it. Round, 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 back and forth, trying to find a blood spot, trying to find a track. Nothing blue except those two spots. And finally, I was a mountain out there in about the right direction. I went on top of that mountain. I, had, I climbed a rock face of that mountain. You know, it's impossible in here, really, but I did manage to work my way up like a rock face back and forth until I got up at over spots. These are tracks. These might not be the right direction but well, they don't necessarily mean it's right oh I heard you another buck standing down there I don't believe this one it could be if it is he's getting ready to drop but you can't take a chance that it is him because I don't believe it is I told you the buck Now we got a choice of two, see? Yeah, that should be a long shot too. I don't want to don't really want to hit his track though just yet. Because it'll mess up this track. And it's in the edge of the woods, straight above everything here. Let me back up, I got something I'm gonna do. This has cost me time on wood and him too. I didn't see which direction that was closer for sure. A little closer straight in. Between that and the stand, I would work. I should be able to find that blood spot. I keep hitting that button up there instead of the map button. You have to move your hand to go in and out. I see I'm too close. I can't really <coughs> set it any close for me this close. Right there now. Try that. I'm wasting time, what I'm doing, but I want this here closer to me. The blood spot's what I want. No, right there in front of it is. <coughs> Still hear something walking. Now, see if I can set that tag or it didn't. I'm gonna let it go just to the just a little short of that tag and oh yeah, I should be able to find it from there. What's walking out there? <coughs> little dope there, I think. Yeah, we're gonna let her go. That's most whoop 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 whoop. Well I guess I I need to go on to this done. <coughs> we know that blood spot. We know that's his. We don't want to mark it. If you mark it, it switches on you. Or either that it marks both. It switches on you. What it does, and you lose your original. There's my original right there, probably. So I if I switched, I'd have lost temper for now. I had to come back and find him later. I'm going to go ahead and do that. It may be the other one, but I, I believe this is him. But see, watch our tracks. But go away. I'm pretty sure that's the one, the first one right there with two shots in him. Nope, one shot. That's not got the. That's not the first shot. That's the second one. Oh, I can't be sure, but he only got one shot in him. Both lungs. All that blue one away. It's okay. Let's go back there to our track. <coughs> if I was on the right track, there I might have switched tracks coming out there though. If I if I hit every one of his blood spots, it'll switch on me. Let's go back out here and find his his blood spot. If it's gone, then I have to go back and pick up the original some way. Which is one right there by it, so it don't matter. 
I see his blood spot, or I see a blood spot, that's all that matters. If it gives you a direction, we picked up the second one first. If this gives me a direction, it gives me this. I picked up the second one first. Yep, I picked up the second one first. That's what I thought. Because the first shot on, on a deer won't give you a direction. So I'll tell you what, how much damage you've done. See there? What I did, I switched one of the blood spots coming down through there. He should go far. As close as I was, a double lung shot, probably. The thing about it, he can get lost in that little short distance just to the point you can't hardly find him. Now here it shows that he turned. And that's the idea. Well, they want you to learn to do all that fool. They don't give you no blood spots half the time. There we go. He's doing pretty good today. We got his tracks right here. Should be him. There he lays. I told you he wouldn't go far. Not on flat footed all this country. But if I slow walk back to this thing, I might still have a chance. That's two good bucks already. That's a good hunt. All right, look at that rack. Now that right there was a big one right there. He was the one I was after right there all the time. I just didn't even know it when I done it. This is the first one here, not the last one. I didn't hit him but one time, though. Integrity is 100%. Quick kill was with zero, but integrity was 100%. I didn't even look at integrity on it. it should be as right. long as you got one. I missed him. Looks what happened there. But I know I gave two shots. Apparently, I missed him at a second shot. How far west of the tag? It's just another hundred yards almost. If I slow down, and walk slow. The hunting will be more likely to be usable for another. I see a bed. On what that bed is, maybe that deer just picked up. I doubt it. Though. He's all his. I don't know if the blue all only the well, I guess the blue only goes away because there's tracks right there. <coughs> it shows I picked him up, but his tracks may still be there. Won't be no blood spots. Shouldn't be anything on the GPS at this point either. Oh red fox. About to live on the bucks there. Get a shot at him, but he's pretty tricky. Coyote is 1200 or so. This is all about the money in my part. I'm not keeping trophies. The idea is to keep the game moving. I've got $3,500 right now. That's $35,270. Yeah. That's what I thought. Okay. Uh, it took me a long time to get up there, though. But I bought everything. I'm now about ready to buy me another tent and. You put me another tent and another tripod that will have optional. I can put two at a time if I want too close together. Like when I was at that, yesterday I was at that uh, logging camp. There's two good sites. I wouldn't mind setting up both of them and switch back and forth. Then you could jump in tent to tent. You wouldn't have to walk. Go through here and head back down to the herd. My four wheeler where I parked it. Head out across that field, all we got to do is. Uh oh, I see blue tracks. Oh, I marked that fox. That's him. A red, a red, a red, a red fox. That's what that is. I forgot about that. See, he coming this way too. Come or go, which was it? He's going the same way I am. That was just a slim chance, but a chance I walk out here on him. He's pretty tricky. I've killed two or three, one, one or two coyotes. It took me forever to find a bison, but I got in a spot a couple of days ago and I killed five or six. Foot. I, I got knocked out once, but I killed about six, between six and eight bison. Quit about one o'clock in the morning. I've been hunting all day in the same area. <coughs> Hunted all day. First thing I was trying to, there's a big buck, and I saw him moving. It. He went behind a rock and he nearly come out. I you know, bison started coming by and I started picking at them. <coughs> After that you forget the book. I hunted till one o'clock at night here. I don't know how long it was there, several hours in the game. Several hours real time. But anyway I 
knocked off several bison. Had a visitor come in. Acting a little weird. Anyway, that's beside the point. Anyway, he uh, was, uh, actually he wanted to help me, but it was, I was already ready to quit for bedtime when he come up. Uh, I don't know exactly where I'm at. I do, but I think I'm in one field too far over. 39 to there. I'm up in a different field, I do believe. Well, that's over yonder in the other field. Oh, see, I see a few tracks up here, though. Nothing happens. Just remember, up the hill, there's <laughs> another field, open country. I'm not going to hunt too long. It's, it's going to be a good hunt right now if I stop it. But again, it's, if we don't come up with something pretty quick, we'll, we'll call it. Like a short hunt, and people will watch it. Easy to upload. I'm not going to edit it. It's going to be as is. That's, I try to do my videos as is, but they don't always. Right, right down in here where I marked that 18 month. Got to be out across under that tree. Down here walking, you can't really tell. Let go to the four wheeler, and that should put me on most of the side of the rest of it. <coughs> and right there where last spotted that deer. They helped me get back to my right place. If you mark one, but try not. I did finally pick his blood spot up too, but I didn't, didn't want to. So I knew it was crisscrossing. And it did, but once you get one of them out of the way, then the other needs are fine usually. You get two and they're running back and forth, you pack those going crazy. But I couldn't turn down and shot that second buck. Was a nice book there. That was really big. That that last last was nice. Over this hill, we yeah we got our stand in sight. Yeah, on, on the, at least on the the hundred yards down a little better. Uh, <coughs> Sit on tracks out here right now. We didn't even sleep, did we? I was going, I generally sleep before I start hunting. We can sleep for a new day, too, if it looks like you're going to need that. In fact, it probably wouldn't hurt to do that. I don't know what time of day did I say it was for a while ago. Quit that. I'm just trying to shoot that thing. See, we're on heavy hunter in this place already. It's almost 3 o'clock <clears throat> in the afternoon. We sleep overnight. We might get another deer out of here. Two big bucks. You couldn't ask for much better. Especially since could have been just easily been a couple of little wiggy pigs or something. But I hadn't. I, I had never called. I, I was going, getting ready to call. I hadn't called. I don't think. Just I went to call. I spotted him. Like I said, I, I call. I call everything. I call. Take take turns. I figure if that other animal thinks the other animal's there, it ain't gonna matter. In fact, it's better to him think it's not male, sir, that's not scared. If he thinks it's a, a different type of, of moose or something standing down there, or elk, if he thinks he's standing down there, well, he ain't scared, I can go down there. <coughs> that's the way I see it, unless they're scared of each other. And of course, they would fight probably or run away from each other but anyway in here you seem to be able to just go through all the calls do what you want to do and whatever comes comes unless you've got a certain purpose i haven't been able to call elk yet i've killed one i think somewhere along the line but when i call them they don't come i don't hadn't checked into that maybe something i have to do exactly before i do it I'm doing a little double call on the I didn't call twice, but yesterday I had one hollering at me for, just before I quit. I checked him, you know, I walked out across there. Another thing, I'm not real sure, but it seems to be that, that I don't have a call for the follow deer, the big buck. In fact, the one I just killed one won't follow, I think, but no, it wasn't. He had different rack. Follow deer got them flat horns. But I think this sucker bugles. Well, if you blow that bugle, and 
he don't come to it exactly. Sometimes they do seem like. But you can blow that bugle if he. What I was going to say is that I heard one bugle. It was all certain direction from it. I blowed and he blowed back. I thought it was an elk. But when we got in sight, I spotted that follow deer in the same place where he sounded like he was at. He nearly bugled back while I was looking. The fact that he didn't have time, because as soon as I seen him, I, it was a long shot, and I switched that drill rifle and plugged him. A drill rifle a long shot is... It might not take him down, but it'll take him down. It'll take, it might take a few minutes. And I took a drill rifle and took down two bears at 230 yards, dropped them in their tracks, shot them in the head. They were facing me. Twenty, about 10 feet apart. I, but one wasn't there when I was, it was both there, but one run up and turn around and come back. Coming right back within about 10 foot of the other, and I dropped him right where he was at. It don't happen every time, but it was two good shots at that long range. <clears throat> I killed a deer at 320 yards roughly in here with it. Alright, now it's time to, we know what time of day it is. I don't even like to hunt this time of day. Let's make, let's give it a little quieting down time. That's what I'm thinking, I'm going to give it some quieting down time. Speed the clock up just a little. Uh oh. I don't like to walk like this. The more noise you make in the area, the more likely you're not not to find that. Now he makes this way. He's sort of quiet. You walk right up on some deer, as long as the wind's behind you. Now, the wind makes a world of difference. I know that. I've seen that. We can take us a little nap. Then we're gonna check him out in the morning. So we'll be just a few more minutes. If we don't find them, we're gone. And what I do is I go forward to the next day and about five and I like to be almost six. Five forty five, five fifty. Not that it, it gives you a little bit of early time to get on it. Usually ain't nothing going on at that time to match anything. Still about half dark, suddenly glaring. Beautiful time of day, but most time you're looking into the sun, you can't see. It's been about 30 minutes an hour before you see. But I mean, game time about five minutes here. We still got tracks, so we still got animals. Tracks have been gone, but had been something supposed to be here. Sometimes be empty for a few minutes, and then the tracks come back. <coughs> Late enough day, animals don't pass through. Now, what we got? Anything on the fields. What's that light glare I thought I saw something? No. Well, we're going to start off with some. Now, the deer calls I got is not matching what I'm hunting either. That's all I got. I can't find nothing else to get, actually. I, I got. Oh. Oh. Regular deal call, bleep and a the rattler. I did rattle a while ago, I think. I don't remember if I did or not. I remember starting to. Don't want to do too much. That's actually a little too much right there. Like you make like you move his head around while I do. But usually a holly don't move his head on the way, so I thought there was neck stretched. <coughs> now I got a little dose complete. This right here gets me in trouble. If I'll have a dose, sometimes I have dose walking everywhere. But if you have, if you have for the money, that don't matter. After everything I've said done, I can drop about a half a dozen dose. <coughs> making money. But this time, I'm trying to keep this down. Oh, let's see the tracks doubled in. A bunch of little bit dope tracks out there probably. I don't think they're coming out. We got a thing right here. That's a pig. I don't want that. And I use this right here. And sometimes it seems like they start they start to walk when I use it. See, I know it's elk. 
and elk don't come to me with it, sometimes they'll answer. There's a I don't I don't have the other little call I always use. I don't have it with me. I don't want pig call right now. If it is pigs, I don't want them up here right now. Go back to this one. Give them time to settle down, see something to show up. It's a little early, the sun, sunlight glaring hard to see. I see something. Maybe a little doe. Yeah, that's a doe. But I hear another one. He stands still, see it? That little dope bleak brings him out, out of the woodwork. See one, two, th three does out there right now. Well, I see two. I feel like they were They'll get up here too close and run off again. I'd like to make 600 bucks right there. If you get one of them, might get a bow. If he flinches and stops, he kiss it goodbye. Go back to here. See if that buck come out back there somewhere. And sometimes there will be a little buck in that bunch. They were standing still and I was still here and walking. Here. I heard a step pull that deer moved. Maybe they may have a step saw, but I heard a step pull that deer moved. See him? I keep hearing an extra step, I believe. Well, number five. Let's check around the woods out there. Check around, see if there's anything standing out there looking at me. Sometimes they'll stand on the edge of the woods and just stand there. What the old big boy does, he stand back and look. Sometimes. Let's go to another call. Paul heard one up there also. Hear him? Screen real quick. Oh, well, we can't take that now. But with the glasses, they don't show up. <coughs> See, they bugle, but they don't answer back. different. Just in case he walks up. 30. I hate to take that chance on that one. But I know it. I know that I missed with it. I need to shoot it, but I need to shoot it when it don't matter.
He looks dark to me. Dark like that usually means they're a buck, a little buck. Uh oh, see, I scared him. But the wind is his inner favor for him. You don't want to go out here because they scare them, but at the same time, they will give that buck a sense of security. If they don't run, thinking everything's clear. And I have had him to sneak up behind him a second time. Probably not going to see when we done kill on him. Too. Other than the other call I got to access deer, but I think what's in here is a red wild follow deer. Is all I've seen so far. Not gonna be here much longer. I'm gonna pack up and get ready to leave. Come back another day, maybe. It's already just pleased me on what I've done. I heard you, you don't know. One of them little does coming back. They're going to run again. Time to pop if he's going to. Cause any closer he goes, he break and run. But right there, he's ready to break. He smelled me. Who would that man think? They want to run the other himself. What are you running for? He'll generally break and run two foot over on just cause the other did. He said, you done that last time, and I didn't. I didn't run, so I'm not gonna run this time. I'm gonna save ship. I'm gonna stay. All right, let's try one more time. The head go up. It ain't because he saw me, because he smelled me. One more book, because he was a little one. See, he picked me up here, and he smelled me. Who did that man think? I think I'm going to call this a day before the, before the video gets too long. We ain't going to worry about tiptoeing. Let's call it a day. Lay down and take a nap and read and get rid of all my toys. Get up here high as I can. Crawl up there. There we go right there. Now, uh oh, he turned from around. Where did they go? Anyway, that's it for now. It's town. I'm going to bye bye and I'll catch y'all later. We'll put this up and see what it'll do. This first video of about six days, and I don't know what I'll make another day unless I make a couple. I may make a couple, two or three days for different things, or two or three of these, whatever. Anyway, I'm going to catch y'all later.